so much comfort in knowing that, that Caroline saved the lives of four people. It's absolutely huge to me that, that we were able to do that much for families that didn't have to lose their loved one as we did. She was able to give vision to someone that was unable to see. That probably touched my heart more than her organ donations. I'm sorry. <laughs> Sometimes they say that you um, you feel better when you're with people who are like you or have been in your shoes and I knew that a lot of the people in that room walked in our shoes and I knew that they uh, had, had felt the pain that we, we always feel since we lost our daughter. Pouring the sand by my husband and my, and my grandson was probably my most emotional moment throughout this entire trip. It was a bittersweet moment, but so happy they did that and, you know, joined in. It was a very emotional time. We met the family that did the floor graph and that was so touching. The gala was amazing. That was where we actually started to make friends and meet people and talk to others about, you know, their losses as well as ours. It really was a bonding experience. It was so exciting to see her beautiful face atop that float today. I, I just can't explain the emotions that we both felt we were excited, we were sad, we were happy. It was just rewarding in every possible way. And to me, she looks way high up on that float, and that's exactly where I think Caroline would have wanted to be, at the very tip top. And so it was even more rewarding to have her. It looks, to me, she shines more than any other photograph on the float. <laughs> I immediately cried because I saw her face, but, but then again, I was so proud that my daughter was a part of this experience and that she was on that float here at the Rose Bowl and uh, I, at the Rose Parade. I can't explain to you the feeling that I got whenever that, that parade, that float went by. I was just thanking the Lord that, you know, that we were actually selected and our daughter could be a part of this experience. I would love Bridge to Life to know that I'm so grateful that my husband and I were chosen to come to, the, to make this trip out here in California and to um, honor our daughter. I, I'd just love to let them know that it has really been a meaningful experience. It's actually been, I think, a step in a healing kind of way. I'd say, why not? Why, why not give it when, when you can? Why, you know, there's no need to take it with you. You can leave it and make somebody else's life, several other people's lives, you know, go on again. Her cousin David Walters once said of Caroline that he was so proud of her for, do for changing the lives of five strangers by donation and that he said, believe me, if you didn't know her, where she went, a parade would follow.